Hey everyone, let's play Nightingale. Yeah, okay. I'm here. Good, good. So my realm is not lost. I my Carnot is not transparent anymore. Interesting. Because I was fighting the bosses there or what? Who knows? So at least I kept all of these. Can come back here anytime. So to make ascended. Oh, that I need in the better uh, enchanting table. So cut gem, carved wood, and got enough space there. So ascend, ascended. Okay, so need just code. Oh, that's very easy to make. First, let me make some inventory space. So this will be 100 round power. That means. I'm most likely able to get the right materials. Wait, I already got Antiquarian Ascended card. Okay, okay, so I don't have to make one. We'll see. It'll be the druids. Yeah, sounds good. Uh, easy would be, uh, it reduces the level. Okay. In 220. No. Ah, I already... Oh boy, I already made the bench. I forgot about that. Oh, great. Oh, well. Okay, the portal to the Ascended Antiquary is open. We're gonna go through there. We'll see what extra stuff are there. Maybe I'm gonna build a new base there. We'll see. Most likely need to gather all the new materials in order to craft the... Uh, your free items. I might have to buy like new clothes. So here we go. Okay, we arrived. Uh, vibrant as, all, as always. The Essence Trader is close by. There's the Fate Tower. Another one is there. I think most likely this is the Essence Trader I need to look for. Let's go the closest one first. Hi guys. Oh my goodness, these hurt a lot. That insane amount of guys spawning. What the hell? How many is them spawning? It's crazy. Yeah, it seems like they up the difficulty of the game a lot. Technically, what I should do, just go to the vaults, craft everything from there, because the players will carry you, and then I just simply be more powerful. For me, for me, like, I have 125 X pick or refined mode. And I still don't deal enough damage, and they deal lots of damage despite me having 100 gear score. Is there a logic behind that? So technically it's worth just rushing there. Though getting essences is much quicker in these realms. So what I was thinking, just craft a strong weapon and I can blaze through these. Yeah, at least you get tier 3 essences. Trader is there. Ah, Astrola uh, Ascended card. Sure, let's buy that one. These getting so expensive. I do need to buy these. Charm ammunition. Tends to keep their ammunition. Oh. Oh, that sounds nice. It's like come back later, but. I need to 
fight through these guys here. What the hell? They threw. I've never had them before. What the hell? Why are they flying around? Ah, oh, with the shovel ability, okay. It's so hilarious. I need to acquire tier 3 essences. Agatha Harris. Uh, Agatha Harris. Is he in the night bot? In the watch? Yes. Yes. Okay. That's what I'm gonna learn. I'm gonna learn at Revolver. Technically, I should ignore this. Because I could easily get... Oh, hello there. Why are you attacking? Because I was cutting the herbs here? That's why? Yeah, I go away then. I think it's always one, yeah. It's so aggressive, and why there are so many? And they are so tanky. And I have a hailstorm as well. It's like the game purposely doing it against me. Uh, blocking takes stamina. Now the sound effect is bugged out. So the shockwave not work because the sound effect. Uh, what could I say? If if you make your items the same level as the realm level, you kind of would expect that you're powerful enough to deal with them. Yeah, of course I can kill them. But they are way too powerful and they overwhelm you with lots of them. And you don't get more uh, blueprints from these anymore, unless a uh, higher level maybe. I would say it's better to do the vault first and then you acquire some better weapons. With that you can easily go here and collect your essences. Because you get high level tier items as well. Those. Mm. Apex creature materials. You can use it for yourself. Technically, you can. What you can do, like, get high level uh, gear, like tools, and with those tools, you craft the necessary items. You're a unique NPC. Sorry. Survivor's Calamity, yeah, your yeah, box, into them, okay. What happened? Great for that, I came up lucky. Look, what kind of name is this? I'm supposed to pronounce it. Rathli Floki Vikl Guardson. Like, who wrote this? Who wrote this? And corrupt. Looking for, appreciate, there's a, okay, oh, okay, you're right, I my safe travels, nice, at least I got some free items, what kind of trader is this building, ah. good thing I came here, I might have to come back here for the NPC. It seems like I have to come back. So that means I have to like travel from here, this portal here constantly for finishing up this quest maybe. <sighs> and the quest bugged out again. If you use your essence, can drop it and get it back, right? Okay, 
that works. Good. So I guess I go back to my, I mean, Bada Watch, finish the quest and see what's the next. Most likely I have to come back here. Yeah, let's deliver the year three essence. Basically, I already collected from the other realm, but it's fine. No question, I have request, I have the resources. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. This work, yeah, useful, definitely will be. Yield. Now we have to talk to Alan. Yes, anything mine? Needs for research. Yeah. Yep. 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 I don't feel any different. Yeah, community. Yeah, yeah. Blah blah blah. So the guidance. So I got the revolver. I got the quest. I mean achievement as well. Okay, until then. So, that's all. This is the main quest only. There's nothing more. So, the game is finished till here. So, the main quest is done. There's no more main quest. Maybe later they add more or just I didn't find it yet. Maybe I need to trigger it somewhere. I do need to, like, grind up to get better gear because I cannot deal with the 100 the higher level zones but once I'm got those done how do I say this game is unfinished this game requires polishment especially performance wise hopefully they add the offline mode very soon because you know I don't want to depend on the servers not many people have good uh, internet connections or some, sometimes, sometimes you don't want the internet connections sometimes it's, the PC loads much faster than the connecting to a server waiting for the server to answer of course going through realms is not that long but sometimes you have to wait too much what kind of game I would play next I think I still gonna play this game to get reach out the max level and I gonna showcase my amazing building whatever I made maybe but maybe I just drop it off because it feels like a tedious farming it's nice that it has this multiplayer feature but this game I don't know I'd rather play with friends and I assume later on they add more portals here I assume there will be like Maybe three more biomes, like winter one, maybe, uh, I don't know, swimming, ocean-like, the water zones, the, basically the swamp already, but maybe they're like gonna invent something like that. What else they could have? Tropical biome, maybe? And I would say that for the apex vault, uh, the desert one is the easiest one, the forest is all right the swamp is a really annoying one because of the water effect so like look i walk around this thing it's like jump your backpack is jumping around this is not really well optimized game their crafting system is all right uh, they really need like chest that connects to the crafting station they, they promise that they're gonna add that but then they're gonna add it it's like i don't know how they how long they need to be this done power did it and shrouded did it why they cannot do it because of server issues i think if they put this offline maybe everything can be solved let's just see more players than before maybe because of the server regions you can apply i'm on the hong kong server so this will be my last episode and i just go play another game maybe another survival game maybe i go play Elden Ring. I'll see what kind of content I'm gonna make. So anyway guys, thank you for watching and see you next time. Bye bye!